Welcome back. A local food blogger once again transforming fast food into gourmet food. Danny Grubbs is what he goes by on TikTok. He presented the chef with a McDonald's Happy Meal, chicken nuggets, fries, sweet and sour sauce, two apple pies. Chef Amy Brandwine transformed the separate ingredients into a tortellini dish. She blended the nuggets and the apples together to make the filling. The pie crust was made into breadcrumbs. The finished product looks pretty good, but some people think it might be a little on the small side there, but what do you think? I think points for creativity, Marina. I don't like this about me, but I would eat it. I mean, what? Everybody likes McDonald's and how it tastes. Do we think it's great for us? No, but I'm here for it. And, and the, you know, it's it's frou frou presentation. It, people are going to love it. Yeah. And by the way, for those of you who are complaining about how small it is, because that was the majority of the complaints, I mean, isn't that why they say bon appetit? Bon appetit. Isn't it petite? It's supposed oh, to be small, right? right? No, that's like no. appetite. Oh. Oh, okay, whatever. Uh, it could go back both ways. Is that ways. just drawing on you? I don't know. I'm not French, but we all know that. <laughs> Although I do know some French words, okay, but I can't table. say those on TV. Sur table. <laughs> yeah, sur la table. Great, great, great <laughs> score over at Tyson's. Uh, and Napoleon Bonaparte yeah. is from there, too. We all know this, okay? Have you ever and had those little escargots? Yeah, I love escargot. Yeah. Um, and... <laughs> Chukatori and Fagwo and all that Fuego. stuff. Okay, whatever. <laughs> so you, you, you almost swore in Italian there, so <laughs> <laughs> I was started. It's petite. The difference is you're taking it. That's why it's called transformation, right? Yeah. It's going from Happy Meal yeah. to, which is petite in McDonald's terms to begin with, right? Yeah. To gourmet. I mean, when you go to a gourmet, get gourmet meatloaf, you ain't getting the whole like loaf, okay? <laughs> right. uh, with ketchup on top. Yeah. So to me, I, I think that it was very unfair how they treated this. And, and I would definitely do this. I do think that as an air fryer, mm -hmm. Person. Like, sure. this is a lot of work for a little benefit, but maybe that's what makes it so special yeah, I mean, I so think fancy. Yeah, all that, but like, you don't you don't imagine chicken nuggets and, and uh, apple pie going into something Appetite, that's a little, really? more, <laughs> a little more fancy. I am just impressed with the creativity. As somebody who just got her first air fryer this week, and that will be, like, the greatest adventure what? in cooking, I don't ever cook, <laughs> ever. Um, I think it's creative, and anything that can be done like that in the kitchen, I just bow down because I couldn't even, like, put the apple pie in the microwave to eat it like this. Wow, you and Angie need to hang out more. I know, I found someone who is, who is less capable than you me. You may be kitchen Didn't think that was possible. I think, we, I think we got our cooking show yeah. right there. There we go. We're done together. Right, as Aaron Kumbo looks on in horror. Yeah, sorry, that's not, not my contribution. All right.